Mandisi is a PE born musician um, who came to Cape Town to study after school. Uh, all my musical life has been developed in Cape Town, um, whether classically African music, uh, jazz, choral music and all those things. So I'm that kind of a musician. Um, I've been working a lot at the theatre, uh, writing music for plays and, and films. I conduct a church choir. I've played in a reggae band. I've, I've played everything. Um, I play trumpet and I sing as well. Um, I came to finally, you know, um, after um, years um, of people waiting for me to release something, um, I decided to go um, to the studio and record um, my first album. And I called it Somanja. Um, because for me, everything that I am, everything that my journey, um, when I look at it and, and, and look at the things that I've passed through, um, it's not of my own doing. You know, I believe that there's an Almighty who's been looking out for me, who guides me. And so it was a, a fitting title to call it Somanja. But also Somanja is a, is a song in the, in the album that talks about um, a person who's lost you know, um, in whatever sphere of life and who goes to the creator and says, um, you are the one who's created me, I'm lost, I cannot find my way, so tell me, you know, um, what is this next step, what should I do? Uh, and so the whole album, the whole feel of the album is that, the whole feel of the album is a, is, is a, is a person asking questions, um, more of a person who's always trying to discover things. Um, we start off with a, with a, with a tune I learned as a kid, you know, just um, when we're singing in, ch in, in church choirs or school choirs, the first song we'd sing when we got on stage would say, Molweni, Molweni, as in, hi, you know, all we bring is music, so kid, we have your attention. Um, and and it, 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 I felt that, for me, that, 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 that spoke of an era, you know, that I come from. Um, and then I ask a question, as I, as I, I say, I say, Kusegude. Um, um, we still have a long way to go, you know. If if things continue the way they happen, you know, um, the plight of of, of unemployment, um, kids raping um, our parents, parents raping kids, um, we've become animals, you know. At, at some point, and I, and I go, I go. We still have a long way to go, you know, to restore our humanity. I go and talk about Inzingo, you know, Inzingo Zamza Zewandi. Yeah, uh, my story is mine. Don't look at me and think you know my story by just looking at me. No, my story is mine. I own my story. And then I go to a, a very personal song, um, which is called Oluetu. You know, Oluetu was my younger brother. He passed at 21, you know, very young age. I had lost some people, you know, I lost some people before, but losing him, I could not deal with it. I couldn't, I couldn't because for me, he was a young life, you know full potential and all it is just that it's a song full of that of those questions but also a celebrating a life you know um, and then straight into all it I go to I search you know probably right in at, at my lowest moment you know in that whole uh, period of me losing him you know I go I search I'm just searching for you know uh, a sense you know I'm searching for strength search, searching for for you know a path you know to to walk after the, after him, uh, which then leads me to the song um, because you knew less, you know, because there are, there are moments in your in your confusion, in your anger, and in your um, uh, uh, the, the turmoil that happens in your head, where suddenly the answers come, you know, the answers come. They say you might not have known this when it happened, but this showed you this, you know. I'm a very spiritual person, so I believe in the spirit world and, and what the spirit world shows and tells us. Um, and, then I, and, then I, and then I had to break it, you know. We had to break it for the audience uh, uh, and go to a, a song, I, uh, probably the song that I, I heard my mother singing, you know, when she was washing clothes and stuff like that. She used to sing, uh, I didn't know what it meant at the time, and I used to follow because I used to enjoy singing with her. With her. But it's just a, um, a family that is ostracized, just put aside 
because of the way they look. You know, people don't give them a second chance. And so therefore, um, I, I then thread that song to a, to a song that I composed, so called Ingo Manyinke Dam, the song of an orphan. You know, but it's a song of an orphan in a different way because it's saying this person is content with where life has put them. You know, but it's just saying, don't look at me and feel sorry for me because I had it all, it was fine, it was fine, but then life happened and I find myself here now. And I realize that this is also fine because I'll find myself somewhere else tomorrow, you know. And then after I've, I've, uh, um, I'm finished with that, you know, I come back, I, I'm, I grew up in PE, you know, and PE is known for Abandaba, uh, we used to call them Mama Ivy. Beta, the people who used to dress well, you know, and who were Max, you know, they, they, they spoke nicely with girls, you know, and, and then they were my role models, you know. And I also grew up, you know, at the time where men used to sing beautiful love songs, you know, just to, you know, just beautiful love songs. And so I wanted to tap into that, you know, because you don't hear them a lot. And so I, I, I wrote a song and I say, Molo Sisi, Njan, Mpilili, now. You know, because guys in those days all needed, they only, only needed a minute, you know, just a minute, you know, nothing else, just need a minute to state my case and that's it, you know. And then the song uh, that follows that, you know, that sort of love corner, if you want to call it, is a song called Dimtanda. Dimtanda no me vuk. E amba sen zindo zake, kum nyama, kum klope, kusasa na semin, e kum vile, e kum vile sen zindo zake, you know, where you love a person, for just being themselves, just G, just G. You don't have a reason. You look at them. You know, you know. People in relationships will understand that sometimes when you've done wrong and your partner, you know, scolds at you, and you look at this woman, you think, "Hey, but I love you." Even if you, you know, when at that moment where 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 you're scolding me, I love you. You know. So that song is like that. You know. And then I uh, I go to a I call it a a, a personal prayer. You know, um, or a personal conversation again with the Creator. Um, there's a Sutu song in in in, in that, that, that that I know. It's called Likunutu Limorena, which means in my secret place with my with my God. You know, and 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 Kode Kubenin is that type of song. You know, when you've been trying, when you've been working hard, you've been diligent, and you've done everything, but it just seems like nothing is working. You know, all of us have been there. You know, you go Kode Kubenin in How long is it going to be? You know. Um, um, I've, I've, I'm doing everything according to the book, but, you know, and, and you look at other people and other people are prospering and everything is happening, but you, it just seems like all the doors are closed, you know, and, and, and for me that's an anthem, you know, that's an anthem for everyone, you know, because all of us get to that. And I finish off with, uh, with a beautiful song, um, <laughs> my grandmother's dance. That's my mother, that's my grandmother's song. Um, one of the people who shaped how I think, you know. Um, old people, you know, when they grow old, they've got this thing when they sing, they don't finish melodies. They go, ba da da, ba da da, ba da 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 ya, ba da da. You know, and it's got that, that method is beat, you know. Do, 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 you know. Because all these songs either come from my upbringing as a closer man, all these songs come from my upbringing as being brought into a traditional church background. Um, they come from me being influenced by classical music. They, they, they come from me being influenced by South African music or South African legends or South African, you know, because I'm a student of the music. And this album carries a lot of those things. I'm a, I'm a big love of melodies. You know, one of the things that I, I, I love is melodies. You know, I, 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 for me, if, if a song doesn't have a melody, I, it's not a song, you know. And so for me, I, I always believe that it's easy for you to get the words out when there's a melody, you know. Um, you know? Molo sisi kunjani opini lena bendi tolu mzuzu wakuteta na wemna Molo sisi kunjani no ufili lena bendi tolu mzuzu wakuteta na wemna ufili lena bendi tolu Oh, okay.